yo what's going on to the texas and games team welcome back to another video so in this video i'm going to quickly walk you through how to download shader packs for your minecraft java this is really simple and a bit complex if you are not new to this so just quickly if you are new to this sorry so just follow this and it's very very simple and shader packs are really cool for you know minecraft's gaming experience it's really really cool and it makes the game look so nice with hd textures and a whole lot of stuff yeah so before you think of shader packs you must think of optifine and it's a web i mean a software that helps you run minecraft smoothly uh, with all the hd textures and makes it uh, stand out to look very very well and make and you know it helps you have a nice gaming experience in the minecraft you know gaming so just make sure you download this so you head up to show our versions as i've done then you move down here to a uh, 1.16.1 that's the version i'm using so i'll do everything for 1.16.1 then go ahead and download i've already done that so it will just be my folders I mean my downloads here you just go ahead and run through the installation process double click and just install it and i think you are good to go with the shaders i mean the optifine so just do that and you're good to go if you are finished if you finish just head back to chrome and head up to uh, this website is made by one of our famous minecraft youtubers at yeah, the breakdown he makes also minecraft tutorial videos as i'm doing now then you just head up down here to um bsl shaders that's what i'm using right now so i'll just go ahead and download bsl shaders then i'll click download and I'll run through the installation process. I'll go to a BSL shaders over there. Head up to download. Then move down here to download. But I've already done that as well. So I'm not going to do that. So if you move up to folders, this is how you should see it. In the zip file. So go ahead and extract that. Yeah. I don't know if I should do it. Because I've already done that. But for the sake of the video, I think. I think let's extract the files. Yeah, I think let's do that. So we'll go ahead and extract files. Then just show you just to let you know how it will look so once you are done it should look like this in the folder let me just make sure it's not double folders it's the same one uh, i think yeah it's the same thing so we'll not waste much time so just go back so don't worry about that just go ahead and copy it and paste it in your minecraft shader pack folder i've already done that so i'll just show you how you do it so you just hit windows plus r type in app data over there enter head up to roaming then head up to minecraft then head up to shader packs then once you're on shader packs um, once you're on shader packs you paste it here i've already done that as you see there so you just go ahead and do that for yours as well now once you're done this is the awesome part you just go ahead and launch the t launcher so before you do that head up to the version list and look for 1.16.1 up to find the version you downloaded for is the one you should see but you should see up to find attached to it with hd whole lot of stuff written there then go ahead and use that one select that one and enter the game so we'll do that and once uh whilst it's doing that let's quickly explain to you how the channel will be moving so before we do that if you are installing shader packs be really really careful on the kind of shader packs you install make sure they work really well the first one i downloaded turned my game to completely black and white second one completely made my game so bright to the extent that my eyes were really really straining so just just be very very careful with that and also talking about the channel we are going to be making new stuff and new things all together the channel is going to move onto a whole ambition list so stay tuned because there are huge stuff coming now the tkc will be ending soon i'll start recording the city and everything in shaders now but it will be ending once you are done with all the apartments and hotels if you have any other comments on what we should add we'll do that and we'll end it and we'll be starting a new one which will be like uh, an infinite world but we'll have only modern mansions everything should be extremely modern so that's how we are going to do it and the best aspect is it's in infinite so you have an endless world to roam around in and enjoy yourself in the world yeah so just stay tuned and also i'll be sh making a similar video now to download it for sh uh, pocket edition as well so stay tuned for that video and it's going to be epic and i'll be throwing a lot of mansions the uh, cool mansions in um, shaders uh, really really nice mansions hillside mansions and a whole lot of stuff i've scheduled most of these videos so they'll be uploading very soon uh very very soon so just stay tuned to the channel subscribe and like the video so that to encourage me to do more and never give up so make sure you stay tuned to the text and games team i'll be making other nice and cool minecraft tutorial videos which i think will be really really beneficial not just minecraft other tech um problems that you guys face and i'll just quickly brief you through how to download it how to do this how to fix that anything i find difficulties in and i feel like you guys may be also going through the same i'll quickly make a video about it so 
if you are on the text and games team well done if you have not yet subscribed make sure you subscribe so that you don't miss out the new um, ambitious uh, you know projects and stuff that will be coming onto the channel soon and very soon if possible we'll be playing other games but not really confirmed yet but uh, yeah a whole lot of things will be coming for this year 2022 yeah anyway the game has finally loaded in we'll move sorry for the plenty talking yeah i just want to use this opportunity to talk so once you are done move up to options once the game loads in just move up to options then move over here to video settings then you move over here to shaders then you see bs or shaders there so you can go ahead and double click on it to load it it will reload the game i think i've already done mine already but if you have not done so just double click on the VSO shaders it will automatically reload your game from the mojin screen it will sometimes show not responding but don't worry i think i've already done mine that's why nothing is showing on the screen now i totally forgot to turn it off before recording the video but if you are done if you see the off button there the off button on top of the internal there you just go ahead and double click on that off button and the off button will automatically turn it off and it will not really turn it off it will reload the game again as it did then the shaders completely leave but they'll still be in your shader pack folder so let's uh, hop into one of our worlds i think the city world will be okay which is which hmm modern mansion modern city now i think let's head up to the tk city i used it in 1.16.4 because of the word edit mode i'm now testing it out so let's just use this one and check out how the city looks in shaders this is really going to be epic yes so let's let's wait for it all right so by the way as i said if you have a very good pc you are not going to really struggle with a lot of lags and it won't cause any crash problems and as you see not responding maybe yours will happen but it will happen for like just a, sh a short second and that's that's it so just make sure you have the right pc for this if you don't have a very good pc it may crash your game and sometimes a whole lot of problems it's really problematic shader packs are really really problematic so be very 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 careful with that anyway now let let's do this look at this look at the city man city is now looking very great and cool in shaders so without wasting much time i'll end my audio here while i just roam around in the city displaying how the shader packs look and enjoy and by the way subscribe to the texan games team so that i don't miss out on the new stuff that will be coming up thanks for watching it